The American street artist Greg Habeny has come up with a very unique PR idea to raise his profile in Germany. For one week, the artist has been hiding his artwork around Berlin, encouraging the public to go art hunting. At the city's Strickling Gallery, Habeny prepares his paintings to be hidden, on the understanding that those who find them, keep them. They are, actually, they're not only finding it, they're like stalking out in front of the gallery and waiting like the other night. <laughs> we were followed and trailed. At around midnight, Habany hits the road to downtown Berlin. Clues to his painting's potential hiding places are given on his website. I guess it's good that they don't not for the first time, Habany was beaten to the hiding spot by anxious art hunters on the prowl for their prize. In total, the artist has hidden four different artworks, with some worth up to 7,000 euros. The lucky finders couldn't believe their luck. It's incomprehensible. I never thought we'd spot him. Until now, we've always been too late. That's really great. I think we'll go for a drink now. Well, there's five of us and only one painting. The question is, who gets it for their living room? Maybe we'll have to flat share. All those who didn't get their hands on a Hebony original can discover the Americans' work at the Strickling Gallery in Berlin. The artist's work has been the inspiration for many artists from the Cobra movement and the New York Abstract Expressionists. They're not just blatant statements and sayings. They kind of have a little bit of a mixed interpretation to them. You kind of have to read between the lines. Um, you know, for example, even this piece, you know, Mickey Mouse being an iconic image of America, and he's holding an American flag that was made in China. The exhibition, Appetite for Destruction, an American Nightmare, is an interpretation of American society and the changing circumstances that shape it.